Not all stadium lights glow. Did Donna Kels just diss Taylor Swift? Last week's speculations appeared of a possible rupture between pop princess Taylor Swift and the Eve R opinionated Donna Kels matriarch of the NFL's legendary Kels family. While speculations of Taylor and Travis Kels's romance have dominated headlines Donna's recent star teammates have thrown a wrench into what appeared to be a picture-perfect relationship. It all began simply enough. Donna a regular at Chiefs games alongside Taylor joked with a radio host that her emphasis on game days was on the field rather than gossip. Honey, when I'm at Arrowhead, it's all about those boys in red. Taylor is a great lady, but seeing my sons dominate is what makes me happy. While Donna's remark could be construed as innocent motherly pride, Swifties on the lookout observed a distinct difference from her earlier effusive comments to Taylor. This combined with Donna's rather lukewarm description of meeting the singer as okay during a cha t show appearance has sparked conjecture that not everything in Kel's swift land is sunshine and raw and bows. Adding fuel to the flames Donna was cited at a neighborhood BBQ establishment following the chief s apostrophe latest victory curiously absent Taylor. She was instead observed deep in conversation with Travis's ex-girlfriend Kayla Kay. Was this a deliberate snub or just a coincidence? The online investigators are on the case. There is, of course, another side to the story. According to sources close to the Kelses, Donna has only the best intentions for her kid, and merely wants to keep him out of the spotlight. They point out that she's never been one to hold back her ideas, and her candor should not be misinterpreted as disdain. Only time will tell whether Donna's statements indicate a true schism, or are the ramblings of a protective mama bear. One thing is certain, the next chapter in the Kel Swift tale will be anything from dull. So, grab your popcorn, Swifties, and get ready for an epic drama. After all, nothing is ever ordinary when it comes to love, family, and foot.